Assalamu alaikum beautiful people we are back with another video and in this video we will talk about the new event which is coming in the FC mobile and we will also talk about the things you have to do and the things you ha have to avoid in order to get the maximum rewards in the team of the year so watch this video till the end and don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel so let's talk about the new event first as you know that team of the year is only going on right now but uh, alongside the team of the year there will be a new event which is confirmed and which is already been revealed that it's a lunar event and uh, it will be a side event probably available for two weeks or three weeks and uh, in that event you will not get any high OER rewards uh, and uh, the players and the event format will be revealed soon but now it's only a confirmation that new event is coming after that let's talk about the team of the year in the team of the year i will share you some important tips and tricks which uh, you should follow and which you, the things you are asking me in my comment section so first of all if you move towards the Toti event, uh, most of us have already claimed this nominee path A. Uh, I went for that 89 to 90 to overall player because uh, I was trying my luck. I thought like, why not? I can get a 92 rated card. So <laughs> from the uh, from this action, I got Sane. And uh, you can also go for Mordage and Benzema. My team OVR was higher. I don't need any 92 or 91 rated card. So I went for a tradable card. So you went for any for any of them and uh, after getting all of these rewards you have to uh, 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 claim 30 nodes at least to co uh, complete this u dotty milestone if you can see i have 26 out of 30 rewards and if i will get four if i will uh, unlock four more rewards i will get this reward and then i will get a 85 to 95 overall player and uh, the thing which is uh, really important in this team of the year is icons evolutions i'm trying to say this thing again and again guys if you are claiming this canavaro if you are claiming this lampard or a rivaldo card then you don't use this 85 rated card in the exchanges like as you know there are exchanges in the toti event 82 to 95 85 to 95 if you will mistakenly use this canavaro card in those exchanges you will not be able to get this 93 canavaro card similar to Lampard and Rivaldo. It's because, for example, if you are going to do the 87 overall Canavaro exchange, you have to use this 85 overall Canavaro card in his exchange. So, if you will not have this card, then <laughs> no more high rated cards. You will not get a 93 rated Canavaro cards. And if you have already used uh, your previous base card, then it's game over for you guys. And uh, uh, you will not be able to get this. Uh, based this uh high rated 93 ovr canvaro lampard or the world card you can hope from fc mobile that they give you another base card for free or they change the requirement and they give you a 93 rated canvaro card for free there is there you there is nothing you can do in order to get this 93 rated card if you have already used your base cards and if you haven't claimed this canvaro card then i will suggest you to if you are going to claim it use this canvaro card in your active lineup or uh, don't even claim any of these cards let's get the 40 wins first and when you will get 40 wins then do all of these exchanges in this way you will be safe and if you will ignore this thing then there is no reward for you guys one thing more only claim 100 uh, progress points and uh, in the weekend claim 200 progress points because these will help you to get 100 tokens in the normal days and 200s on the weekend and if you will play extra you will you are not going to get any reward and uh, uh, you can play extra skill games and matches as well if you get if you want to get star pass points or XP, xp points they will help you in that and if you will refresh it for the three times then you are not even going to get uh, 100 tokens so keep this in your mind like uh, you only have to get 100 progress points first and then you have to get 100 toti tokens after that you just uh, you can play these skill games and matches to get uh, star pass points or xp points so these are all the important informations uh, which i want 
want to share with you guys and in the mystery signing there are two new players there is a 90 center mid de jong and 90 right mid, right mid rickon and uh, if you talk about the exchanges i will surely suggest you to do these 80 to uh, 97 overall daily bonus exchange and mixed version player exchange 82 to 97 overall because it's completely worth it to do these both exchanges they will give you tradable rewards the other reward other exchanges are not even that good because they they will give you uh, untradable cards you can also think about this exchange as well this is also worth it to do because it's giving you 80 to 97 overall player with 70 plus ovr uh, 11 players but the best exchange from all of these is this 82 to 97 overall exchange because here you can actually pack 90 plus rated cards it will give you 10 plays so do these exchange daily if you want to get good rewards so i hope this video will be helpful for you guys we'll meet you soon till then bye